Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. The sun is out and riding season is on its way and I'm loving the FZ6 more than ever. Now my most popular video on this channel is me describing 10 reasons why you should get a Yamaha Phaser FZ6 and if you haven't seen that I'll put a link up here but today I would like to add five items to that list. So let's get going but first of all I'm going to do a quick recap on those 10 items. Number one, she's so sexy. Number two, cheap to buy. Number three, wonderfully cheap to insure. Number four, it's actually an excellent bike for pillion riders. Number five, it has fantastic top end power. Number six, it's extremely reliable. Number seven, the attention to detail on certain bits of the bike is absolutely fantastic. Number eight, the ergonomics seem perfect for every size rider. Number nine, this engine and exhaust system is so quiet. And number 10, this is a versatile do it all machine. So those 10 items alone are fantastic and that's enough to get one of these bikes. But thanks to my amazing subscribers, I have five more reasons to get one. So number one, or 11 on this list, it comes with a rear hugger, a standard. That is so good to have. It really protects the rear shock, it's just out of shot. It keeps all the gunk away from up here. And it really, to have that as standard is such a gift. On bikes, they cost a lot of money to add and just keeping your bike tidy and allowing little bits and bobs, bolts that get rusty or even pieces of electric or the exhaust pipe, um, just keeping that clean is just helps so much. Just this piece of plastic and have that as standard. As I said, it's so good. Thank you. Thank you, Yamaha. Thank you. And number two or number 12 on this list is the fantastic fuel economy you get on tours. Uh, I've noticed in previous videos that in town, it, for some reason it's terrible, but out on tours, you get 50, 60 miles per gallon. So I'm spending like 20 quid a day on petrol. So on those types of holidays, your entertainment for the day, which is riding, costs you 20 pounds. I mean, it's nothing. So that really is a real gift. And number three or 13 on this overall list is this big fat 180 rear tire. For a relatively small bike, it's only a 600, you know, it's not a litre bike or a big 1250 or whatever. Having this nice big fat rear tire really makes it look nice and beefy and like a big proper bike. I've been through a few bikes before and, you know, having a little skinny tire just makes you feel, you know, it's not really a proper bike. Love it. Ugh. And number 14 or four on this list, this bike is full luggage system compatible. Before this bike, I've had a Suzuki Van Van almost impossible to fit a top box to, definitely can't do panniers. I've had a Suzuki GS500, that's top box only, very difficult to fit panniers to it or you have to spend a lot of money to do so. I've also had a Suzuki SV1000, which was top box only, used to be able to fit panniers, but um, they seem to discontinue that a long time ago, Givy. So this bike, easily full luggage sets, perfect for everything, shopping, touring, I love it. And finally, number five on the list, or 15 overall is, the center stand. God, having a center stand is so useful just for, you know, checking the chain tension. If you've got punctures, uh, if you need to do work on the front end, you just wait down the back end when the, when the center stand is down. Every bike should have a center stand. It just makes life so much easier. The practicality of it is, 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 is everything. Uh, some people worry it adds a bit of weight to the bike, but I don't care. This is an everyday bike that I need to be able to work on as easily as possible. So the center stand is the best thing. So that's it. Thank you so, so much for watching. That is now 15 reasons why I love this bike so much, an additional five in this video. Um, if you'd like to see the original 10 reasons, I'll put that up in the, uh, in the link below or on screen in, at the end of this video. Please subscribe, please like. Plenty more videos to come, especially now with the weather like this. Oh God. Motorcycling is just a dream, isn't it? Amazing. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.